This renunciant has a very noble appearance, fitting to be a great man. Here in Kuru, it's very hard to find a husband suitable for my daughter, Bagandia, but today I found one. Venerable sir, my name is Magandia. I have a daughter who I would like to get married. But here in Kuru, I can find no suitable husband. And then I saw you today. I am very pleased by your appearance. Please, accept my daughter as your wife. Oh, and don't worry that she's ugly or unattractive. There's nobody in this whole country more beautiful than Magandia. Please, wait here. Oh, my dear child, my dear. Oh, I'm exhausted. Hurry up, make yourself as attractive as you can. Now, right now. Quickly, my daughter. If you're tired, then sit down and take a rest, husband. And why do you want our daughter, Makandia, to dress up prettily? Come on, please, sit down and rest. Oh, Makandia, are you ready yet? Hurry up! I'm ready, father. Right, right. Go quickly. I've met him. I've met him! <laughs> met who? I've met him. Hey, where's he gone? What's this all about? Oh, you've brought me all this way and I still don't know what you're talking about. I've met our daughter's future husband. That's what I'm talking about. I told him to wait for me here, but he's disappeared. Ah, there, you see? His footprints are still there. You're knowledgeable in the texts dealing with the interpretation of footprints. Have a look at them. Two footprints that exactly match in this way are the footprints of a great being. They show that he is beyond craving, beyond anger, beyond delusion, without defilement. Such a one is not interested in household life. <laughs> no defilement? What? Every man likes beautiful women. Let's see what happens when he sees our daughter. The main thing is to find where he's gone to. Oh, over there! I found him! Quickly, wife! Magandia, hurry! Follow your father! Venerable sir! Venerable sir! Venerable sir, this is my wife. And this is my daughter, Magandia, who I'm going to offer to you. Brahmins, I rejected sensual pleasure on the day of my enlightenment. I've seen the root cause of your existence, karma. You arise from sensual thoughts. Those thoughts arise in me no longer. Your karma will appear no more. Brahmins, listen to this teaching. The wise person must put effort into raising his mind out of attachment to sensuality, freeing himself from Mara's snare, steadying himself with the hook of mindfulness. He is able to master himself. He is able to have victory over himself.
Your teachings have illuminated the path ahead for us both. hold it against our daughter. Magandia is still very young. We ask permission to go to my younger brother, to give him all my wealth, and ask him to take over as guardian of our daughter. As for my wife and me, we will ask permission to join the monastic order, so that we may, in time, realize enlightenment. 